this shit! This horribly unfunny episode of Triple THS is brought to you by DraftKings.com! What's up, my fans? I'm the New York traffic of mixed martial arts, Tommy Toehold! And it's finally UFC 205 week, motherfuck yeah! We're in New York, well, UFC's in New York, I'm a fucking cartoon, and shit is going down on Saturday! So it's only fitting that we kick the week off by talking about someone who's not on the card at all! Johnny Bones Jones was given a full one-year suspension by USADA for his failed test before UFC 200. The suspension started retroactively back in July, so next time we see JBJ, it'll be International Fight Week next year. I feel so relieved, Tommy. John, you just lost another year off your career, why do you feel relieved? Oh, lots of reasons. The first reason is respectfully DX suck it. Reason number two, USADA did in fact acknowledge that I am not a cheater. That's right, pussies. All that shit I did before now, like kicking everyone's ass, that was all real. Lion King goat. Ooh, DX suck it so hard, all of you. Fact, USADA said I'm not a cheater, but that I make terrible decisions. Translation, John's a fucking badass who doesn't give a single fuck and will always beat Daniel Cormier every single time no matter what. So John, you've got eight months until the next potential fight. What are you gonna do with that time? Everything. I'm back in the gym getting super strong. Lion King 2 Simba's Pride is on repeat. I'm gonna write a book. Oh really, what's it called? The tentative title is Breakfast with Fuck You Daniel Respectfully. I literally took you down so easy and you were in the Olympics, fuck you. That's a catchy one. John, now that this is all over and done, other than the NSAC hearing, which what could go wrong in one of those, what have you learned from all of this? Oh, I think there's only one thing I can take away from all of this. Right. Be Don't more cautious in your actions. From friends. Wait, what, what was that? What was it that you said? Look, I know what everybody is going to say. Oh, dick drugs. John's just like Anderson Silva. Listen, respectfully, I wasn't taking them for the reasons you're thinking. Not that there's anything wrong with doing that. And even if I was, fuck you. My dick has seen a world of adventures that you couldn't even imagine. My dick will write on its deathbed. I did not tell half of what I saw for I knew it would not be believed. Anyway, the reason I was taking them is because it was fight week and I really wanted to intimidate DC during the weigh-ins. Because nothing says intimidation like a raging boner. Let's just change topics. John, are you worried at all about how this will impact your legacy? My legacy? Oh, you mean that I'm the most dominant champion in light heavyweight history? And even after the suspension, I'll only be 30 years old? Yeah, no, I'm not worried. You motherfuckers better get ready because I'm gonna be taking your lunch money and fucking your favorite fighters up for a very, very long time. We're not even halfway through this shit. See you in July, John, and see you tomorrow, fight fans!